Hey guys, the weather outside is so nice today. You can't miss a day like this. You have to go for a walk. Yeah, I'll bring my best friend, Mikey. I wonder what he's doing now. I really like being friends with him. He is my best friend. I wonder where he'll suggest we go. Maybe go swimming at the river or maybe our playground with the swings. Mikey, open up. Let's go for a walk. Open the door. Are you home? Hey, I'm Mikey. I'm coming, I'm coming. Mikey, look at this beautiful weather. Wow, that's my best friend, JJ. Hi. Mikey, let's go for a walk. I don't want to just go out, but I have an idea. I have something. What do you got? Look what I got. I think we're gonna have a lot of fun. You got a new soccer ball? That's great. Yes. Let's go to the playground to play soccer. Of course we will. But you should know that I'm very good at soccer. So I'm going to beat you, my friend. I've been practicing too, so I won't give in to it. How much farther do we have to go? Just a little bit. We're almost there. I see the set. Let's play. Remember, it's primarily fun. Of course, I just came to enjoy the game with my friend. So do I. You're going to play on that goal. Get in there. Well, I'm here. You ready to get started? Uh, sure. Get ready. I'm going to show you what I can do. I'm looking forward to it. Come on, kick the ball. All right, get him. I'm aiming for the gate. All right, I got the ball. Now it's my turn. Don't miss it. I'm catching him. Wow, that was really close. And I almost nailed it. Catch. Whoa, that was fast. I must have let my guard down. I'm glad you're my friend, Mikey. I'm glad you're my best friend, too. Now it's your turn. Do your best. Get ready, I'll show you how it's done. Go! Wow, I did it, we're tied. You've shown a very good game now. I'm surprised. Our friendship means a lot to me. We've been through a lot together, and I'm glad you're here for me. After all, we can laugh together and share joy. Our friendship helps me to be inspired and find strength. Is what makes our friendship special and valuable. I agree with you. Mikey, I'm tired. Why don't we do something else? What suggestions do you have? We can go play computer games with you at the club. Oh, yeah, that sounds very interesting. I wouldn't mind. Then we'll catch our breath and then we can go. Okay, I'm pretty much ready to move out. You okay? Yeah, we can go out with you. Okay, then let's go out. I really want to play with you. What's that? Mikey, wait. What is it? Come here, quick. A what? Look at that. TV Amphow is doing a concert tonight. No way. This is really great. She's beautiful. Where will her concert be held? The concert will be at the restaurant. I really want to go. But JJ, this is in the other direction from the computer club. Please, let's go to the concert. And afterwards, we'll go straight to the games. All right, let's go to the concert. Thanks, Mikey. You're the best friend in the world. No problem, JJ. I don't care for a friend. Here we are at the restaurant. It should be starting soon. Look at all these posters. Apparently, she's been very much anticipated in our town. How beautiful she is, even in a picture. Thanks for agreeing to go with me, Mikey. Let's go get a table while there's still room. What a big and beautiful room in this restaurant. Good afternoon, young people. What can I do for you? Hello. We're here for the concert at TV Amphow. Can you tell me if you still have tables available? Yes, of course. Please follow me. We just have one table left for two. We made it in time. We were very lucky to get a table. Yeah, we're very lucky. Here's your table, please. Please have a seat. What a cool table. Thank you. The table is really very cool. And it's in the front row. Anything you'd like to order? I don't need anything, thank you. Mikey, you gonna order something? I wouldn't mind a regular lemonade. All right. Are you okay with that? Yeah, it's okay. Yes, everything is top-notch. Thank you. I've heard Amphal perform incredibly energetic. I think that's really true. Look how many people are here. I'm so glad we could come together and that we're gonna go play. I think it's going to be a real spectacle tonight. So we're in the front row. I'm very happy to hear that you like everything. When does the concert start? JJ, see also, I think it's starting. Ladies and gentlemen, I am pleased to welcome you all to the concert of the Irresistible TV Amphal. This is so exciting. I can't believe I'm going to see her live. Yes, JJ, this is really exciting. And so let's welcome our star. TV Amphow. Have a good evening, everybody. It's her. She's coming on stage. Greetings, all dear friends. Thank you for coming. I wish you a wonderful I think she's starting. Oh, we cannot face Do you hear that? We'll always find a way. Her. Thank you all. It's my pleasure. I will continue after a short break. Mikey, please tell me what to do. I don't know, JJ. Should I come over now? Or is it better at the end of the show? I'm not sure that's a good idea, JJ. She's a star after all. She's leaving. I will act. But we were going to go play computers. Mikey, give me a break. Amphow, hello. Hi, what can I do for you? You amazed me. Why don't we go out after the concert? JJ? Honestly, I don't know. I mean, 
you haven't even introduced yourself. Oh, I'm sorry. My name is JJ. Where do you want us to go for a walk? I know a beautiful park not far from here. Is your friend coming with us too? No, I think I'm gonna pass. All right, well, my concert's gonna go on for another two hours. No problem, I'll wait for you. I'll continue to enjoy your singing. JJ, why would you do that? We had plans. I'll see you later, JJ. I'm really looking forward to seeing you. You're really not coming with me. You don't understand, I'm in love. Well, okay, I'll see you later then. I'll see you later, Mikey. Two hours later. The flowers on the trees look amazing, but you are still more beautiful. <laughs> You're such a flatterer, but it's nice. You're just irresistible. Thank you, it's a pleasure. I just can't resist the beauty of nature, especially when it's near you. <laughs> You are the master of compliments. A little farther away, I know a great place. It has very beautiful sunsets. Show me this. I feel so good with you. You're the best. Oh, JJ, I'm having a great time too. Thanks for showing this park. M. Fow. Here we are approaching my house. This is where I live. You live in such a big house all by yourself? Yeah, I don't have a guest room upstairs. All right, then let's go through. Come on in, don't be shy. I'm on my way. You can make yourself at home. What a beautiful and large home. Where is the guest room located? The room is on the second floor. Where are the stairs? And where can I make myself a coffee? You can make your own coffee in the kitchen. I got it all figured out. Thanks for the brief tour. I wonder who's calling so late. Mind if I answer it? No, of course not. Answer it in case it's urgent. All right, thank you. I'll make it quick. Uh, hello? JJ, I'm Mikey. Hi, what did you want? There's been an update to our game. Why don't we go and play? No, Mikey. Amphow and I are at my house right now. I don't have time for games. We're a couple now. I heard you. All right, I'm gonna go play by myself. I'm very sad to hear that. I thought we'd always be best friends. Now he has other interests and I'm all alone. I'm not in the mood to play right now, so I'm gonna go to bed. Six months later. Mike's time to get up. I got news for you. Mikey. Yeah, what is it? Who's there? It's me, JJ. I have some very big news for you. Ampho and I have decided to get married. Will you be my witness? What did you decide to do? This is such a big step. Yes, we understand that very well. We have taken this issue seriously. Are you all set? Or are you just starting to prepare? It's all ready to go. Let's go quickly. We're expected. I don't even know. This is all so unexpected for me. Where's the wedding? We organized the wedding at the town church. Also after it, we plan to leave. Will you keep an eye on the house? How's that, JJ? I thought we were best friends. It turns out we're not gonna see each other. Wait, Mikey, where are you going? We are here today to marry these two beautiful people. Do you agree to be together in spite of the problems? I agree. Do you agree to be with him for better or for worse? Of course I agree. How's that? Now I'm all alone. Who am I going to play soccer and go out with? What am I going to do now? I now pronounce you man and wife. I'm so happy. I'm the happiest man in the world. You're responsible for each other now. Honey, what about Mikey? Why is he so sad? I don't know. When I was at his place, he was just like that. Why don't we talk to him? I tried, but he won't tell me what happened. Let's go. Now I'll try to talk to him. All right, let's go. Maybe we'll get something. Mikey, hi. Why are you so sad? What's wrong? Can I help you? You left me all alone. You two have fun together, and you've forgotten all about me. Oh, Mikey, I'm sorry, but we didn't forget about you. I'm still your best friend. We never left you alone. I'm really sorry about that, but we can still be friends together. It's true. Nothing's stopping us. Mikey, what do you think? Oh, really? I agree to continue to be friends with you. Yay, I'm glad to hear that. I'm glad we're friends again, too. I have a proposition. How would you like to play soccer? That's a great suggestion. I agree. You're the best. Let's go quickly. We were able to figure it all out. I'm really glad we're all friends again. So are you ready to play soccer with me? Of course we are, but I'm not bad either. I'm glad we're all friends. I'm very excited, too. Let the game begin. Amphal, pass the ball. I got him. Mikey, catch the ball, my friend. Watch my most invincible ball possession. It was beautiful. I got it. Throw it to me. I'm so glad we're all playing together. I'm very excited, too. I'm happy we're doing this together. I'm even happier. I missed you so much. A few moments later.
Here comes the penultimate concert of our all-time favorite star, Speaker Woman. Let's hear what the star has to say. Thank you all so much for coming out to hear me sing a song today. Tomorrow will be my last concert in this beautiful city. I look forward to seeing everyone. Love you all. See ya. Mikey, did you feel what I felt? Her music is just magical. It was the best concert we've ever seen on TV. I agree. I got goosebumps while listening to this beautiful music. It would have been cool to be at the concert. Yes, but the tickets are very expensive. Mm, but I want it so bad. We can only enjoy her beauty and music from a distance. Mikey, but just imagine the mm. scene, the scale. Okay, I agree. I'm bought off by what you say. Yay, then we have to go there. Hmm. Ah, are you waiting for someone? Hello, it's the mailman. No, I'm not waiting for anyone. Hmm, and I didn't order anything. Maybe it's our dad. No, I don't think so. Then who could it be? He said he was a mailman. Oh, he keeps ringing our doorbell. It's annoying. Let's open the door for him. It's not nice to keep him waiting. Let's hurry up, because that sound is starting to annoy me. Okay, JJ, if I don't come back. Mikey, don't play tragedy. Mm. Open the door. Okay, okay. Hello? Hello, who's there? Oh, good afternoon. I have an important letter. May I come in? Uh... I'm a little confused, but yes, you can pass. I don't get it at all. Greetings to the lucky fans who have had the opportunity to get free admission to a concert by a not unfamous star. Stop! What? Speaker woman. Oh my god! Holy turtles! JJ! It's just unbelievable! I'm just so shocked! I'm speechless! I understand how you feel! You were able to win such a large-scale contest! Cool! I congratulate you! <gasps> Here you go! These are your concert tickets! Our private tickets! Thank you! Thank you! You're welcome! Don't forget, the concert is tonight! What, today? Yes! Why? Last night's program was on TV! Oh, I get it! Goodbye! Bye-bye! Bye! JJ, just like you dreamed, we're going to the Speaker Woman concert! This is so cool! It's gonna be a great show! I can't wait to get started! Mikey, we need to look at the start time of the concert! Yeah, you're right! We'll have to see! Wow, that's really soon! We should really hurry up, JJ! Yes! The concert starts in an hour, and we still have to get to the designated place! Blah, 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 blah! Well, then why are we standing here? Let's go over there! Uh, Stop Stop standing there and let's go. Let's hurry up. JJ, which direction do we need to go? Now we need to go right. Okay, I got it. Let's go. Hmm. Oh, and JJ, I have a question. So what's your question? Can you bring your own food? Oh my god. Oh, JJ, you were right. We've only been walking for half an hour and we're here. Mikey, if you think this was an easy hike, I'm about to get mad. It's okay, don't worry. Wow, this place looks really, really cool. Let's go over there. Mikey, wait for me. JJ, we're here. Wow, for real? Yay! But I guess we're too early. No one's here yet. Those multicolored lasers look top-notch. I agree, it looks cool. I'd love to have one of these in my house. I wonder if we can go inside already. What are you talking about? Uh, we, as real fans, have to meet the superstar right here. Uh, okay. I'm overwhelmed with excitement. How long do we have to wait like this? It's so cold outside. Oh, JJ, that must be her. Wow, that's such a cool car. She's definitely here. Look at this. Wow. Oh, I'd love to have one of those cool cars, too. Hmm, where's our star? You don't think it's her car? <gasps> oh, my God. Hey, everybody. Hey. I hope you're ready to rock tonight. Mikey, it's her. Oh. Excuse me. Can we film you for TV? Of course. Thank you. I'll ask a couple questions. Cool. Mikey, I don't believe it. This is so exciting. Will you take a couple pictures? Of course. I specifically brought my camera with me for tonight. Wow, Mikey. <laughs> yes, I spare no effort even for such small concerts. Mikey, take a picture soon. I'm trying, I'm trying. Come on, do your best. There's no way I'm gonna be without at least a souvenir photo. JJ, all the pics are done. Great, we're waiting for the show to start. What? <gasps> oh my God. JJ, they wanna kidnap Speaker Woman. I can see that, Mikey. Why did they come here in the first place? Oh no, I don't think she was their target. Where are the gods? Mikey, we have to help her. I agree with you. Then let's go. It's horrible. Where were the gods? How did they get in here? I don't know. Hurry up, hurry up. Stop right there. Do you hear me, stupid toilet? Where are they going? Wherever they go, they cannot escape escape our justice. Wow, what powerful words. Mikey, it's not just words. I'll show you what I can do. There are so many of them. Working together, we can do this, Mikey. Very, very scary. Attack if you have the strength. Come on, come on. JJ, look out. Mikey, I'll do it myself. Don't interfere. This is my fight. Let's go. You're the only one left, and I'll do to you what I did to your friends. JJ, you took him down with one punch. Oh. Respect. I agree with this boy. Are you all right? Oh, huh. Hmm. Please come to your senses. Oh, where am I? You were dragged away by the skibbity toilets, and I couldn't turn a blind eye and... Oh, so you're the one who saved me. I'm immensely grateful for you. Oh, courage. don't thank me. No, I can't leave my savior without gratitude. Hmm. Please, let's have dinner together. Oh, uh, what? What do you say? Of course I agree. <laughs> How can I say no to the most amazing girl? Wow, that's her phone number. Call me a little later because they're waiting for me. Uh, okay. Lady Speaker Woman. Lady Speaker Woman, hmm. are you all right? Yes. It's a sensation. Hmm. Why did they want to take you away? Uh, JJ, is this exactly what I think is going on here? Yes, Mikey. I was able to get that girl's phone number. Wow. She said she wanted to have dinner with me. Wow, that can't be right. Watch this. That's pretty cool, JJ. Mikey, do you think I'm worthy of her? I think you need to dress up a little bit before you meet her. Great. Then I'm trusting you with everything. What? I'm counting on you. All right, JJ, I'll do my best. Cool. Oh, I still can't believe she's paying attention to me. Yeah. 
I hope she doesn't turn your head and you don't forget about your best friend, right? Of course, Mikey. I can't do that to you. Okay, let's go. Bye, my lady. Huh, JJ, you look so happy right now. Really? Yeah. Oh, it's because I'm really happy right now. My best moment ever. The next day... Guys, I've got the number of the speaker woman. We should call her and set up a meeting. Okay, I need to find she in the contact book. Hmm, aha, found it. I hope she gave her number. Just pick up the phone, please. I wish it was her real number. Hey, speaker woman, how are you? Hey, JJ, I'm good. How are you? Me too. Listen, I've been meaning to ask you, where are we going for dinner? Don't worry about it. My helicopter will come and get you where you need to go. Great. Well, I'm waiting for your helicopter so I can see you soon. Bye. Okay, I'll wait for you at the spot. Bye. I can't believe a helicopter is coming for mine. Not way. I can hear him already. I should get out of the house and meet him. There he is. He's so beautiful. I'm so lucky. I've never flown one of these. Hello? Speaker woman sent me to pick you up. She's doing everything. She can to get me to have dinner with her. Let's hurry up. I'm coming. Quickly. Well, I don't seem to have forgotten anything. Then we can go. Okay. Wow, that's a lot of buttons. It must be hard to control a helicopter. I could never do that. If you learn how to do it, it's not hard. Wow, it's so high up here. I now realize I'm afraid of heights. Well, or falling from it. Oh my God, we're finally here. I thought we'd never get here. Or worse, crash. Wow, this place is so beautiful. Oh, who's that? Welcome to Speaker Woman's Possessions. My name is Liam, and I am her butler. Hey Liam, can you tell me where I should go? I'll not only give you a hint, I'll even guide you. Follow me. That's why Speaker Woman sent me to you. Your dinner is ready and she's expecting you. Thank you, Liam. You're very polite. This is my job, and here we are. You look so beautiful today, Speaker Woman. Thanks, JJ. Have a seat. And you, Liam, you can be off for the day. I don't need you yet. JJ, why don't you say anything? Tell me, how did you get here? Don't be shy. Take everything you see. I cooked it myself. Thanks. Everything looks very appetizing. Got here great. I really thought we were going to fall, but it went well. I want to ask you something, can I? Of course you can. I'm not forbidding you to talk to me. Great, but can you get up? Because I'm kind of nervous. Don't worry. It's not like I'm biting you. Just calm down and say what you want. Okay. I didn't want to rush, but I'm that kind of person anyway. Will you marry me? I realize it's too soon, but I love you. JJ, I love you too and want to be with you. So, yes, I will marry you. I think we will make it work and have beautiful children in the future. Four to six days later. Dear guests, we are gathered here today to witness the marriage ceremony of this beautiful couple, JJ and Speaker Woman. If anyone is against it, say so. JJ, you promised me you wouldn't forget about me. Speaker Woman, are you ready to take this fine man, JJ's, as your husband? Yes, of course I agree. JJ, would you be willing to marry this gorgeous speaker woman? Yes, I agree. I'll be with her for better and or for worse. Then I pronounce you man and wife. You may kiss. Mikey's standing there all upset. I'm gotta do something before the marriage is over. May I make a speech? Of course you can, darling. We will listen to you carefully. Thank you, my love. Oh, well, I'm worried. Is the microphone working? Can you hear me? Mikey... I'm so sorry we stopped being friends. I didn't mean for this to happen. Honey, if it wasn't for him, we never would have met. So we should thank Mikey and I'm so sorry. JJ, I'm so glad to hear you say that. Of course I forgive you. We are best friends after all. I'm so happy for you that you found such a beautiful wife. Give me a hug, my best friend. Come to me, my friend. Mikey, I'm sorry again for forgetting about you. I'm so embarrassed right now. Don't worry about that, JJ. I'm so glad you didn't forget about me, even on such an important day in your life. It means a lot to me, my best and only friend. Thank you, Mikey. I am so glad. My husband has a friend like you. Thank you. The next day. Oh, the weather is just wonderful today. I hear there's a new TV woman settling in nearby. I should stop by and say hello. Oh my God, this house is beautiful. Such a beautiful house. Must have a beautiful TV woman living in it. I hope she's home now. Hey, hello. Isn't anybody home? Oh, there's no one here. What a nice table. Oh, I hear something upstairs. I guess I wasn't imagining it. 
Ouch, these bushes are so prickly. Oh, those are my favorite flowers. Oh my god. I'm gonna plant these rose bushes right by my window. <laughs> hmm. It looks amazing. Oh, I hope she doesn't see me or I'll look like a bandit to her. She's such a wonderful hostess. I have to meet her. Hmm, what's that sound? Oh no, it's the skibbity toilets. What are you doing here? Uh, it's weird that toilets can swim, don't you think? Hmm, you didn't like what I said? Oh, stay away from me. I didn't do anything to you. Why do you want to hit me? Help! Why are you guys so fast? Ah, help! Stupid toilets, what do you want from me? Oh, my TV woman. What's going on here? Oh, is it those pesky skibidi toilets again? Hello, can you help me, please? Yes, of course I'll help. You can do it, TV woman. I'll deal with them in no time. Wow, that's the power. I wish I could have such a powerful ability. Then my TV woman wouldn't have to protect me now. Oh, my God. You okay, stranger boy? You dealt with them so quickly. <laughs> I really appreciate your help. Please take this flower as a thank you from me. <laughs> I realize that one flower may not be enough, but I'm giving you all I have. Wow, that's so sweet of you. Oh, did you really like that flower a lot? Of course. I'm so glad. Why don't we go out together sometime? Yeah, I'll finish my stuff and we'll go out. Ugh, I can't believe what's happening. She actually agreed to go out with me. I'm the luckiest guy in the world. Hey, hey, hey! Wow, Mikey. Hey! Hello, my friend. It's been a long time since I've seen you, JJ. Yeah! How are you doing? I met a beautiful lady. Oh, do you want us to fight over a girl again? What are you talking about, Mikey? You know what I mean. I don't want us to test our friendship again. Oh, hmm. Well, shall we go for a walk? Oh, who's the lovely lady? Uh... Wow, she lives in such a beautiful house. Mikey, stop! JJ, let's go take a quick look. But Mikey... Oh, she's cooking something. Oh, no. What a beautiful TV woman. I want her to be my lady. Oh, my God. Mikey, I don't agree with you. What's wrong? I was trying to tell you that this is the beautiful lady I like. Well, then we'll have to compete for her heart. Mikey, that's not fair at all. Oh, beautiful lady, may I borrow just a few seconds of your time? Oh, no. <laughs> what do you want from me, little TV man? Uh... I can't believe a TV man like me was lucky enough to meet you, my beautiful TV woman. <laughs> oh, they don't notice me at all. You're such a nice girl. I don't like it. I have to do something. Would you let me walk with you for a few minutes? Uh... Oh, my God. Yes, I have in my backyard a whole field of flowers as beautiful as yours. Mikey, stop flirting. We're in trouble. JJ, we don't have a problem. Mikey! Because we're about to go on a date with my lady. I can't just stand there and be afraid. Now I have awakened my true power. You're all finished. Attack! I can defeat these skibbity toilets and thereby be able to save my TV woman. And you silly toilets can't even lay a finger on her TV head. I was able to do it. Oh my god, JJ, what happened? I've become so much stronger just for you, TV woman. <laughs> Will you accept my strength, kindness, and love into your heart? <gasps> I'll take all your feelings away. Let's go for a walk. JJ. Hmm. Hey, JJ, wait, what about me? What about you? Yeah, what about me? Hmm. What about our friendship? You were flirting with someone I liked without noticing. Hmm. And you put her in danger. Oh. I'm sorry, Mikey, but that was very uncool. Cool. <gasps> I'm leaving with her, bye. Stop, what? Well, my lady, I'm sorry about that performance. It's not a big deal. I've got a place in mind. Let's go there. I don't regret arguing with Mikey at all. He deserved it. But I'm a little sad. Oh, what a beautiful sunset. <laughs> hmm. As lovely as you are, my beautiful sunshine lady. Am I your sunshine? Yeah, I told you, this place was awesome. <laughs> huh, and I'm really glad it's you who's with me right now at this moment and not Mikey. Hmm. Oh, I'm still so mad at him. <laughs> But JJ, I thought you and I were best friends. I can't believe you chose that TV woman over me. We were destined to meet. I'm so happy I met you. You're so cool. I spend a lot more time with you than I used to with Mikey. Uh, oh, sometimes I miss those times. I don't understand, JJ. If you miss those times, why won't you talk to me? I miss those times, too. I don't belong here. Don't be afraid. I'll catch you. It's gonna be okay. And before, JJ, you helped me. It's so unfair. You're my friend. Jump to me. I'll catch you. Come on, my love. I'm so tired of standing like this. I got you. Catch me. Hooray. See, you can trust me. Oh, no. I can't look at this anymore. I'm the strongest. I will never let you down, my lady. You are the light of my heart. My ray of hope. You're the best thing that ever happened to me. My life is so much brighter with you than it was with Mikey. Well, that's just absurd. <laughs> How can you say that about me? <laughs> I miss our friendship so much. I can't believe all this. <laughs> you are unique to me. You didn't see that coming. I'm here for you, my diamonds. Yeah, I'm going to dig up a lot of diamonds for my beautiful TV woman. I'm sure she'll appreciate all my efforts. Uh, I'll take every diamond in here. Hmm, 
and no more Mikey to interfere with my happiness. Yeah, I've been looking for a place to store a vein of diamonds. Uh, you. And suddenly, it was right next to the police station. This is exactly the police station I was talking about. It was really close to that diamond vein, but I don't think that's a big deal. Who, my lady, I'm coming your way. Whoa, what's this here? What, 10 diamonds for a gold ring? Of course I want it. Oh my God, I got a great idea. I'm gonna buy this ring and propose to my TV woman. Hey, where's the salesman? I really need to buy something from you. Oh, those travelers. Come out, villager seller. No rest. I need that ring. Oh, hello, dear customer. Hello? Are you interested in this lovely ring? Yes, I like it very much. For only 10 diamonds, I'd be happy to give it to you. Hmm. This beautiful gold ring came from the other side of our continent. Uh. It was made by the finest jeweler in the world. Okay, I'll buy this cool ring from you and give it to my lady. Thank you for buying. If you want to give this ring to your sweetheart, this is the best choice. Yeah! You are always welcome in our store. Goodbye. Uh, bye? And now I'm gonna put this sign in the trash can. Huh, what? I need a vacation. Hmm, uh, okay. Now I have a beautiful gold ring for my lady. I am definitely ready to propose to her. Yeah! I hope she'll say yes to me. I remember her walking around here somewhere. But where did she go? Maybe she walked into the wrong neighborhood and now she's being threatened by some skibbity toilet thug. Hmm, oh, there she is. I'll go to her unexpectedly and surprise her. Hey, my beautiful TV woman. Uh, I'm so excited to meet you. The time we spend together is priceless. Wow, what a ring. I've been thinking about it for a long time. <laughs> Would you like to be my wife? What do you think, sweetheart? <sighs> hmm. Um, are you still asking me? Uh, huh, what? Of course I'm asking you. I'm telling you yes. Really? Oh my god. Wow, are you really going to accept my marriage proposal? <laughs> yeah, nice. She said yes. I've never been happier. I'm so excited. I want a cool new wedding suit for myself. Uh, I'm organizing our wedding in the best place in the world. You're gonna love it. You can count on me. Uh, we'll buy you a new suit. We'll get a new TV for your head. It's the happiest day of a girl's life. Most beautiful bride in the world. Do you, TV woman, agree to marry that beautiful in every way man, JJ? Yes. Do you, JJ, agree to take this wonderful, well-loved TV woman to be your wife? Yes, I agree. Then in sadness and in joy, uh, in sorrow and in celebration, on the most ordinary day and the most incredible. Oh, my God. And also on the dullest day and the merriest. Hmm. And also on the saddest moment and the happiest. <sighs> oh, God, I'm so tired of reading this. Anyway, you can seal your marriage with a kiss. Well, my TV woman, are you ready to kiss me? JJ! Uh... Oh, JJ, I'm so sorry. You completely forgot about me. Hmm. I miss our friendship so much. Let's take it all back. Cancel the wedding, priest. Are you sure you don't want to marry this beautiful girl? No and no. I want my friendship with Mikey back. Do you really want our friendship back? Of course I want our wonderful friendly days back. And you're not mad at me? I'm not mad at you at all, friend. <gasps> and I believed it was true love. I'm sorry, honey, but it's too soon for me to get married. <sighs> I promise you that in five years or ten years, I'll definitely marry you. JJ, look. Uh, who is this guy? It's so gigantic. I'm shocked. He's so muscular. <laughs> That's right. You can move mountains with those muscles. Oh, my God. Uh, JJ, I don't think you're marrying her anymore. Oh, uh, what? <laughs> All she wanted was your muscles, JJ. I can't believe it. Turns out she never loved you. No, Mikey. She's leaving me. This is a nightmare. How could this happen? And I've worked so hard for her. JJ, since she dumped you and I didn't dump you, uh, I expect you to apologize. Please forgive me for everything. I've been waiting a long time for that. For all you've been through, I'm ready to grant you one wish. Now, my first wish is to catch up with that twee woman and show her some real muscle. Yeah, let's go. Let's go. Two thousand years later. I'm going hunting with Mikey today. I'm gonna need my bow and arrows for this one. I'm ready to go hunting. All I gotta do is go get Mikey. Hey, Mikey, come on out. You're late. We gotta get to the hunt. Hmm. <clears throat> Did you fall asleep in there? Who is it? It's me, JJ. Let's go. Oh, hmm. Hey, Mikey. Hey. We were supposed to go hunting today. I'm not sure. I thought it was supposed to rain. What are you talking about? There's not a cloud in the sky. Hmm, okay. Mikey, look at the bow I got today. Wow, it looks super sturdy. Yeah. It's settled. Hmm. You're the only one hunting today, JJ. But why just me? Because I don't have anything to hunt with. All right, I'll hunt alone. All right, good luck. Mikey, come with me. Oh, yeah, let's go. Come on. Okay, okay. Hmm. JJ, why did the hunter go on vacation? Oh, not again. Why not? I don't want to hear it. You're kidding me again. Huh, because he decided to 
aim for somewhere farther away than the nearest woods. Huh, well, if you want to, we'll go to the mountains, three hours out of town. Oh, no. Then stop joking around and let's go hunting. Okay, JJ. Oh, I see my first target. It's a juicy pig. Careful, don't spook him. Don't worry. That's my lunch today. I'm gonna make pork patties out of this pig. I'm drooling already. Hmm, that's it. Just a little bit more. Oh, he saw you. No, Piggy, wait. I've already got it. You were talking too loud, JJ. Wait, Piggy, don't run away. What are we gonna do now? Let's get her. What for? Or we won't have lunch today. Oh, no. We have to catch that pig. Why don't we just eat instant noodles? No! I want meat. Then get the pig. Come here, you animal. Catch the pig, Mikey. Ha! Huh, you're almost in my hands. Oh, Mikey, wait a second. Whoa, whoa, who's that? Oh, why don't the people of this town grow flowers at all? It's so beautiful. If it were up to me, I'd plant flowers all over the world. Uh... I almost got you, you animal. Ha, huh, yeah, I got you. Look, JJ, I caught our lunch. Ha, huh, where'd JJ go? I'll go show him my booty. Hey, JJ, where are you? I got the pig. What is that? <gasps> I don't get it. What's going on here? JJ, what's wrong with you? Who's he looking at with that weird look in his eye? Is that the new girl in town? This girl sure looks good. But that's not enough to break my friend. I'm not wrong, right? What's so good about her that JJ's so stunned? Oh, that girl is my ideal. I have to meet her. Get a grip, JJ, and meet her. All right, let's go. I can do it. Hey, hello, pretty lady. Well, hello there. My name is JJ. Nice to meet you, JJ. May I ask your name? My name is Speaker Woman. Wow. I just moved to a town near here. I'm sure you'll love the nature here. Huh, yeah, I think so too. Yeah! Listen. Let's meet up again later. Uh, Here's my phone number. Wow, what did I do to deserve all this? You're a nice guy, JJ. Uh, okay. I'll see you later. Bye. Oh, she's so adorable. I can't believe I got to meet her and I got her number. Hey, hey. Oh, I just met her. JJ, what was that? Oh, Mikey, I've forgotten all about our hunt. Uh, yeah! I'm sorry. I'm not interested in our hunt, but who was it? Uh, her name is Speaker Woman and she's so cute. Oh, I don't like this. Hmm. The next day. Oh, Mikey, where are we? This is an amusement park, JJ. Wow, we're gonna go out and have fun today. Yeah. What's it called? Look over there. Oh, it's Hero Fair. What an interesting name. That's right. And there's a lot of rides, too. Really? Yes. Let's go and see it. Okay, let's go. I can't wait to ride the roller coaster or see the Ferris wheel. It's supposed to be really cool. We'll ride there and then here. Huh, okay. Wow, look at that. There's a show. Hmm, looks interesting. Yeah, there's a fountain doing a recital. Huh, I hope I enjoy his water show. Wow, that looks amazing. Yes, you can watch the water flow endlessly. You're a philosopher, JJ. That's what the monks used to say. I hear you, JJ. Hmm. Show's over. Let's move on. Wow, that was fast. Okay, I'm coming. Keep up with me. There's plenty more to see. Okay. Let's get a move on, JJ. Huh, let's go. <gasps> I know where we're going. Huh, what? It's the best local attraction in the area, and there's nothing better than this. Oh, Mikey, you really want to go in there? Yeah, I'm fully prepared, mentally and physically. Huh, all right. Oh, Mikey, there's a line for that ride. Oh, do they all want to go there? Yeah, they all want to go on it. Come on, JJ. Why don't we just cut in line? Are you sure about this? I really want to ride this roller coaster. Uh, okay. Yay, you can buy a ticket over there. Oh, hmm. Good afternoon, dear guests. One diamond for a ticket? That's a ripoff. These are normal prices for our place. Oh my god, all right. Give me two tickets, please. All right, thanks for buying. You're welcome. Here are your two tickets. Hmm, okay. Have a good day. Goodbye. Hey, JJ, you got the ticket. Yeah. Now we just have to stand in this mega huge line. Oh, life didn't prepare me for this. Life is not predictable. Maybe not. But you know, it's just the two of us, so we're gonna have fun. Yeah, you're right. Look where you bought the tickets. It's the coolest, most exciting, unforgettable, delightful roller coaster in the world. I won't be sad. Way to go, JJ. Now let's stand in that big line like real men. Oh, Mikey. What do you say? I'm gonna have to step out for a while. Stop! What? Huh. Hey, speaker woman. Oh, JJ, hey. You here for some fun, too? Yeah, I was told it's the best amusement park. Yeah, this is the best amusement park in the world. Would you like to go to the cafeteria for lunch with me? Yeah, of course. Hey, hey, hey! Come here to my place. Oh, Mikey, I'll come back a little later. But JJ... We won't be gone long, will we? Sure, we'll just have lunch. Great! Two hours later... Hey, who's next? Can I get through now? Yeah, you can go ahead. Cool. Oh, and now it's my turn. Go ahead, there's still room. No, I'm sorry, I'm waiting for someone. Oh, okay. Yeah, you can go ahead. Well, thank you, kind man. You're welcome. How cool. Oh, where's JJ? That's not funny. He said he'd be gone for a while. So where is he then? <laughs> you know, the first time I saw you, I was just shocked. What? In a good way. <laughs> You're so beautiful, I was afraid to go near you. Huh, I'm glad you decided to meet me after all. I'm very happy too. 
So where do we go now? I think we should go to the rides. I agree, it's an amusement park. We need to have fun. So why are we here? Listen, I'd like to win a prize for you. Would you mind? Wow, of course I'm okay with that, JJ. Wow, you're really good at hitting those targets. Congratulations on your win. You're doing great. Thank you. Here you go, this beautiful unicorn I'm giving only to you. Oh, that's a beauty for me. Yeah! Thank you, JJ. Oh, have we reached your house yet? Yes, we've come to my house. Wow, it's interesting. Would you like to come visit me? Oh, no, my lady. I have to go meet Mikey. Let's do it another time. We'll be sure to hang out at your place together. Oh! Okay, uh, I'm glad I met you. Bye-bye. Oh, bye, honey. <laughs> See you later. I'll miss you. Oh, that was my best date ever. That cute girl kissed me, too. I can't wait to tell Mikey all about it. Oh, wait a minute. What time is it? Oh, is it night already? I can't believe I took so long. Mikey, I'm on my way to you, my friend. Hey, honored guest, we are closing now. Oh, huh? Could you please leave this area? Oh, sure. I apologize for the inconvenience. That's all right. We'll be open again tomorrow. Come back. Thank you. Goodbye. I've been standing here all day. Oh, I hope I'm not too late. Oh, here comes Mikey. Hey, Mikey. Oh, it's you, JJ. I'm here. Let's go on your super roller coaster, huh? Can't you see it's been closed for a while? Oh, am I really that late? You're not just late. You've been gone all day. I'm so sorry, Mikey. Where have you been all this time? Well, I went on a date with that lady. Oh, great. So while I was waiting for him, that's what happened. Mikey, wait, where are you going? I'm getting away from you. Mikey, I'm sorry. Oh, what am I supposed to do? I did such a terrible thing to Mikey. He'll never forgive me. And we were such good friends. Why did I do that? Oh, I have to do something to get our friendship back. Oh, speaker woman. Oh, hey. Hello, my lady. JJ, why are you so sad? I got in a big fight with my best friend and I don't know what to do. Oh, isn't that the cute boy who waited in that very long line for Yeah, you? his name is Mikey. Oh, JJ, you really need to apologize to Mikey sometime. But I can't think of anything. It's a little weird that you don't know what your friend likes. I know what my friend likes. For example, he likes roller coasters. Oh, I have a great idea. Come on, tell me about it. JJ, you just said it yourself. Uh... We'll build your friend a personal water slide. Oh, Oh my god! And that way we can all be friends and play together. Cool! Isn't that a great idea? Yeah! Hurry up, hurry up! Here we are finished making a reconciliation gift for Mikey. We really hope he likes it. Yeah, it turned out really cool. Cause we're very anxious, aren't we my lady? Yeah! Let's finally show this slide to Mikey. Phew, is this the moment of truth? Let's go. Okay, I'll be fine. Hey, Mikey, it's JJ. I'm so sorry about last night. Open the door. Let's talk. What? Oh, Mikey. What do you want from me? I got something for you. Hmm, how are you going to put up with me? And what is she doing here? Yeah, she helped me with this surprise for you. Why don't you come take a look at it? Hmm, well, if that's the way it is, I'll just see what you've got in store for me. Yay! He said yes. I'm worried he won't like it. I think he's gonna love it. Look. Huh, he loves it. Huh, JJ, what is this? Huh, what? When did you build such a big slide? So what do you think? I'm so excited. Yeah. Can I ride this water slide now? Huh, ride it all you want. It's your own personal slide now. Wow. Thank you, Speaker Woman, for your help. I didn't do much, but I'm glad I helped rebuild your friendship. That's so sweet of you. Oh, look, there he is. Hey, JJ, I'm here. Mikey, you ready? Yes, you are. Come on, then. Get down that slide. We're waiting for you. All right. Here comes the turtle, Mikey. Let's go. Wow, that was fast. This is so cool. Huh, that looked like a lot of fun. Yay. It's not just fun, JJ. It's a total thrill for me. It's all thanks to her. I forgive you. Cool. I'm so glad. Yay. Let's all have fun together. The next morning. I'm in a very special place right now. You all have no idea where I am right now. It's a park that they built near my parents' house. It looks really nice. I like it. I'm going to walk here every day. Oh, and this place is especially beautiful at night. Help. Oh, who said that? Help me. Oh, no, she needs help. I'm drowning. Help me. Oh, wait a bit. I'll help you now. Please hurry. Oh, my God. I must hurry. Okay, one, two, go. Yeah. Relax, I'm right here. I'm really scared. Hang on, I'm coming to help. Oh, I can breathe. Are you okay? I'm so tired. All right, let's get to shore. I'm depending on you. Come on, hold on to me. You're going to be okay. Oh, if it weren't for your help. I'm right here now, so you're going to be okay. Look, the shore's coming up. Oh, I'm having a hard time moving. Hold on a little longer. We're near the stairs. I'm holding on with all my might. Oh, we're out of the water. 
Are you okay? Oh, I was so scared. Thank you so much. You're welcome. I was scared. I was sad. And then you showed up and saved me. Oh, lady, you're embarrassing me. If there's anything you need my help with, just let me know. What are you talking about? I can't be in debt to my savior. Oh! Also, would you mind walking me to my house? Yes, of course. Let's go. Yay! Let's go quickly. Hmm. I was afraid I was going alone again. Why were you afraid? Do you know why I ended up in the water? Hmm, why? Because I passed out while walking by the shore. It's a nightmare! As sad as it sounds, I'm fine. Oh, I'm glad you're okay. Thank you. Oh, I have to step back for a moment. Hmm. Wait for me. Okay. And don't faint, please, dear lady. Oh, uh, well, I'll try not to. Huh, I don't know why, but that lady looks so defenseless to me. Hopefully this flower will help cheer her up. Hmm, there doesn't seem to be anyone. Oh, there you are. Are you waiting for me already? Of course I was expecting you. It's for you. Oh, is that for me? A beautiful flower for a beautiful lady. But I don't even know your name. Oh, my name is JJ. Oh, it's so nice to meet you, JJ. You're a nice guy. It's a pleasure to meet you, too. Cool. Come on, I'll walk you back to your house. Well, I don't mind, because my house is just around the corner. Yeah. And tell me how long have you lived here? Yes, if you saw, there is a house on that bank. Yes, I saw it. It's a beautiful house. That's my parents' house. Wow. Wow. Well, we're almost to my house. It's already dark. Huh, that didn't go as fast as I thought it would. Yeah, but we decided to go for a walk, so don't blame yourself. Oh, thank you so much for our time together, but we're here. Wow, your home is very modern. You like it? Yeah. Oh, thank you. Don't thank me. I really like this house. Oh, that girl. I really like it. I hope we'll see you again and have a good and fun time. Yeah. I really enjoyed walking with you, JJ. You're a good guy. Sure. Thanks for everything. Bye. Bye-bye. Call me later. Sure. Good night. Night. Oh, I was so nervous I couldn't even answer her properly just now. I hope she didn't think I was stupid. I want her to see me strong and that I can protect her from any danger. I'll take her out tomorrow and prove that I'm a good, not stupid guy. The next day. Okay, I've got a terrific surprise for her. I think she's going to love it. It's not just a meeting. It's going to be our first date on the river. All that's left is to put a couple candles in the right place. And it's done. Look at this. Oh, best thing I ever did in my life. I wonder if from above it looks exactly as I intended. I hope so. Okay, I think we're all set here. I also need to check if the mechanism is working properly. Let's go. Oh, yeah. It's working just fine. Huh, she's gonna love this. I've prepared for this date to the max. I hope she appreciates my efforts. I'm gonna call her right now and have her come right here. Oh, be cool. Just be cool, JJ. Oh, I'm a little worried. Uh, hey, who's this? Oh, hey, speaker woman. Hey, JJ. How's it going in there? Everything okay? Yeah, everything's great. I've been meaning to ask you out. Wow, really? Would you like to take a walk with me by the river? Of course I do. Let's go. Oh, great. I'll see you then. See you later. See you later. <coughs> All right, follow me. Where are we going? Just don't peek. It's a surprise. Okay. What do you think it could be? I would love a big bouquet of flowers. Wow, I think you'll get that bouquet later, but I have a different surprise. When do I get to see your surprise? Here, now you can look at it. Oh, already? Look at this picnic. Oh, picnic? Yeah. Oh, JJ, did you really set us up on a date? Sure. I tried really hard. Isn't it wonderful? That's so sweet of you. Oh! I love it. Really? Of course it's true. Oh, cool. Well, shall we go over there? I'm so glad we had such a great date. Huh, I'm glad you like it. Look. There's fruit, drinks, and a place to sit and lie down. Wow, that looks just beautiful. Huh, thanks. Oh, you did a really great job. Awesome. Yeah. Oh, JJ, what's that behind your back? Oh, this is the big surprise for tonight. Wasn't that the whole surprise? Huh, well, look at the sky. You're about to see something beautiful. All right, showtime. Three, two, one, let's go. Oh, my God. Yeah. It's a fireworks show. Do you like it? It's so beautiful. Cool. JJ, I am so excited. I'm happy to hear that. Well, I guess that was the last of the fireworks. This is the best surprise ever. Oh, you know, Speaker Woman, yesterday when I helped you out of the water, you just won my heart. Wow. I've been working really hard, preparing for this moment. JJ, this is the best meeting of my life. Nice. Now would be a good time for a snack. There's a lot of food here. What do you like? Oh, my God, JJ. Oh, huh, what? Oh, no, it's the ski bitty toilets. Why did they come here? I don't know. They're so scared. Don't worry, I'll protect you. What? I always have a backup plan. Hmm. Just watch. Huh, okay. Hey, you skibbity toilets. You'd better run away soon. Because my gun won't leave dust on you. Wow, that's a lot of power. Yes, and that's enough power to destroy every one of them. Huh, that'll teach you a lesson. Don't touch us. JJ, you saved me again. Yeah. You really are my hero. Oh, I defend you for the rest of my life. Then we have one last step to take. Oh, here we are outside my house. 
I'm glad you're with me today. Wow, is this amazing house yours? Yes, and I'm inviting you to spend the night at my house tonight. I'm so glad, JJ. Uh, but I'm afraid I'm going to be in your way. It's late, so I insist. Okay. That's fine. Welcome to my domain. Wow. There's a pool. It's so nice here. Yeah. You even have a pool. Yes, it has built-in heated water. I wish I could live in a house like this. Huh, well, I guess you can stay here as long as you want. Wait, what do you mean? Oh, and this is my living room and kitchen. And the inside of the house is beautiful. I mean, you can stay here with me. Oh, you're serious. You're not kidding me? Yeah, I mean it. Then of course I'll live with you. Oh, I'm so happy. Let's go to bed then. It's really late. Yes, I agree with you. I'm tired too. There's only one bedroom in my house. I'm sorry if it's uncomfortable. That's okay. All right, then come on in. Wow, this is your room? Yes, I have great views of the countryside from here. That's crazy. If you've seen everything, we can go to bed. There'll be time to look around tomorrow. I set my alarm for the morning. I hope the alarm doesn't ring too early. Hmm. Good night, my favorite lady. Sweet dreams, JJ. <clears throat> what a beautiful morning. I slept so well. I have energy for the day. What? Speaker woman is pregnant? But how? We should wake her up and find out. Hey, speaker woman, wake up. Stop sleeping and get up. What? JJ, why are you yelling? What's wrong? You're pregnant. What? What the... <laughs> Oh, it hurts so bad. Be patient. It will soon pass. We will take your wife to the best hospital in our city. Do not worry. She will be fine. You can attend the birth. Or you can wait in the hospital. Let's not waste a minute. I'm on my way. We're waiting for you. Okay. Doctor, just be careful with her, please. I'll be there as soon as I can. I can't believe she's pregnant. I have to go to the hospital and check to see if she's okay. They've been pretty quiet. I'm starting to worry about her. I hope they're doing well. I can't believe I'm about to become a father, but I still can't figure out how it happened. Okay, I'm not going to think about it now. I have to wait until this labor is over. I wonder how much longer I'll have to wait for the end of this labor. Oh, doctor, tell me, how'd it go? It went pretty well. Congrats, you had a baby boy. Oh, and here's your son. What? That's my son. But he's a TV boy. How did this happen? I can't know that. You can go to your spouse and ask her yourself. She's already conscious. Come to the room. Yes, daddy. Let's go quickly to mommy. Is there anything you want to explain to me? Why is my son a TV boy? I don't understand anything. Honey, it's just that I was in a relationship with TV man before you. Doctor... I doubt it's my child. I'd like to do a DNA test. Is that possible? And how long will it take? Of course it's possible. I just need to take your tests. And that's it. It'll take a few days. I'll let you know when the answers come back. Okay, well, shall we go home? Let's go, Daddy. Yeah, let's go. We have to close the doors behind us. I'll stay with you and the baby for now until the DNA test is known. And then we'll see if I stay with you. Let's go home. Okay, then let's go home. I'm so tired. And so, here we are at home. If you want, you can watch cartoons. I love watching cartoons, but I don't want to now, so why don't we do something else? Of course we can. Do you want to go play with toys? Look how many there are. Of course I do. It's my favorite thing to play with toys. They're so beautiful. I can't even choose my favorite. What a wonderful son we have, isn't he? Yeah, you're right. You are the best parents anyone could get. I am so lucky to have you. I will do anything to be the best son I can be. Honey, you're the best we've got. What? Oh, it must be the doctor. I'll go check it out. Hello, doctor. Do you have news for me? Hello. Yes, I have some not so good news for you. Uh, this child is not your son. I am very sorry. I rechecked several times. The result is the same. Zero percent match between you. I'm sorry, but I have to go to work. Goodbye. Oh, my God. It's just as I suspected. You're not my son after all. What? Oh, no. <laughs> I don't want you to leave us. I'm so used to you. Don't go, please. What? No, I've decided to stay with you and accept that you're not my son. Yay! I'm so excited. Mommy, Daddy, I love you so much. Let's keep playing. We love you so much, too. Daddy, thank you for all these toys. You're the best in the world. 
I've decided they're all going to be my favorites. And you won't tell me why? Because you bought them for me. Two hours later. Oh my god! What's that portal? Where did it come from? What? A bottle fell out of it. We'd better hurry up and see what it is. That was really weird. Guys, what do you think this unusual bottle is? I'd really like to know what she's doing. I should pick it up and try to put it up and see what it can do. I've got a frame for it. What if I do this? Wow! Does it spin? What's happening? What is that? Hmm, I think I have a cool idea. Ooh, here comes a local. Let's test the bottle on him. See if it's really magical and something cool happens after it spins. Oh, what's wrong with him? Something's obviously going on. Oh, I think it's time to run. Something's gone wrong. Let's go. Come on, hurry up. Guys, what do you think happened? Write your answers in the comments. In the meantime, I'll figure out a way to get away from him. Oh no, where do I go? What do I do? Why did I spin that bottle? All right, there's a lake up ahead. Why don't we jump in and get away from this madman? Yeah, I think that's what we should do. Oh no, he jumped right after me, but he seems to be lagging behind. Whew, seems to have helped. I gotta tell Mikey the news soon. He's gonna freak out about that bottle. Now he and I can make all the girls fall in love with us at the snap of a finger. Let's go to him. I can't wait to share this story with him. He's 100% not gonna believe me, but I can prove it to him. Mikey is definitely going to love this. Here comes Mikey's house. I can't wait to see his reaction. Mikey, Mikey, open up. Okay, I'll go in myself. Mikey, where are you? Mikey, I think I know where he is. Hi, JJ. Hi, Mikey. You're not gonna believe this. I have some news for you. Come with me. Mikey, you're not gonna believe this. I was sitting in the park, looking at a beautiful view, and then a portal appears out of nowhere in the sky, and a bottle of love falls out of it. I tested it on a passerby, and it works. What? This is stupid! Don't be ridiculous, JJ. It's not right. You're messing with me! No, Mikey, it's true. You want me to prove it to you right now? I'll put it on the ground, spin it around, and you'll fall in love with me. Just stand away from the bottle. JJ, it's not right. Well, let's put it to the test. But I still don't believe what you're saying. You can try all you want. You're not gonna make it. Okay, let's test it then. Stand up by the bottle. Just get farther away. Go on, Mikey. Look, as soon as she points at you, you'll fall in love. And don't tell me I didn't warn you. All right, Mikey, you ready? Yeah, let's do it. All right. I'm spinning the bottle. I'll remind you again. I warned you. So, Mikey, do you feel something? No, it's the same as always. I told you, it's not true. JJ, I love you. Stay with me. You didn't believe me. Mikey, stop. Stay back. I'm gonna hit you. Get off me. I'm sorry, Mikey, but this is for your own good. Oh, no. Fatality. Mikey, Mikey, you okay? Uh, what happened? I'm sorry, but I warned you. You wouldn't listen to me. Yeah, you were right. That bottle really works. See, I told you, but you didn't believe me. Yeah, it just sounded kind of crazy. Now, with this bottle, we can make any girl we want fall in love with us. JJ, can I try to make some pretty girl fall in love with me? No, Mikey. I got a better idea. What's the idea? There's this girl in the neighborhood I'm so in love with. I need to make her fall in love with me. Let's go find her. Yeah, JJ. Let's go find her. And then... I'll take your bottle and I'll make someone fall in love with me too. But no, I changed my mind. I want to be the first one to fall in love with me. Give me the bottle. Mikey, chill. That's my bottle. Ouch. All right, JJ. Let's go find your girl already. Come on. I saw it at the store. Guys, do you think we're going to make it? Mikey, this is the store. Mazik shop. I think it's still there. Let's go. Come on. Let's go. JJ, are you sure this is the store she was at? Of course I'm sure. Are you doubting me? There she is. She's so beautiful. I fell in love with her as soon as I saw her. I'll have her for sure. Go for it, JJ. Oh, you're right. Spin, spin. Fall in love with me. Come with me on a date, my love. So, speaker woman, do you love me? Look, the bottle is pointing at you. JJ, I don't think it worked. No way. Hey, get off me. Stay away from me. Ouch! What for? Mikey, why didn't it work? What am I supposed to do now? JJ, try again. Let's go after her quickly. It should work now. Come on, bottle. Don't let me down. 
Spin, spin, fall in love with me. So, speaker woman, do you love me now? Give me your hand and come with me. I'm sick of you. Get away from me, I said, or I'll call the police. You didn't get it the first time. Mikey, I think the bottle stopped working. Let me try it now. I'm not sure that's a good idea, but take it. What if she falls in love with you? You said it doesn't work. I'm just gonna try it. Spin, spin, fall in love with me. Hey, handsome, can I meet you? Of course, darling. What? But how? How did it work? Oh no, Mikey, you can't do this to me. It's my bottle, and the girl should be mine. JJ, you had your chance, but the bottle didn't work. Now speaker woman will be mine. Mikey, let's go to my house. I got a fancy pool for you. And you're gonna make me some food? Because I'm starving. Mikey, no! I'll make everything comfortable just so you can be with me and enjoy it. Great! Then let's go to your place. Oh no, Mikey, how could you do this to me? We were best friends. What do you guys think? Did Mikey do the right thing in this situation or not? Why didn't you work with me? Stupid bottle. If it wasn't for you, everything would have been fine. We gotta come up with a plan to make things the way they were before. Guys, let's see what they're doing together. What? She's cooking him steaks. But it should have been me. Speaker woman, this is just great. Can you get me some drink? Yeah, sure. My favorite, Mikey. Hold on, I'll be right back with your drink. If she leaves, it'll be my only chance to talk to Mikey. Great, she's leaving. I'm gonna go deal with Mikey and fix this. Let's get closer to him. Well, hello, Mikey. Didn't expect to see me, did you? What? What are you doing here? You're not supposed to be here. You're not supposed to be here. I told you from the beginning. I like Speaker Woman and she's gonna be mine. And you went and ruined it. JJ, you blew your chance when you had it. Everything was fair. You gave me the bottle and I did it. And now you're just jealous that the speaker woman's gonna be my girlfriend. It's your own fault. Oh, that's right? Well, then no one gets the speaker woman. I'm gonna destroy that damn bottle. Oh no. JJ, what have you done? No one can have the speaker woman now. Now, do you know I'm not kidding? Hey, down there. What? Did you hear that? Hey, what are you doing on my property? Mikey, she forgot everything. We gotta get out of here before she comes down. I totally agree with you. Let's go, let's go. She's coming after us. Mikey, hurry up. Hey, you, stop. I've already called the police. If you run, it'll be worse for you. But you loved Mikey. How can you do that? I don't know anyone, Mikey. Stop right now. She's almost on top of us. Mikey, we have to speed up. Oh, Mikey, you and me in jail. Come on, get out of your bunk. No more lying in bed. There's nothing you can do about it. You see what this bottle and the love of women has gotten us into? Yes, JJ, you're absolutely right. But what do we do now? I don't know, Mikey, maybe you have options. JJ, let's get out of here. Mikey, are you crazy? How are we gonna get out of here? We're going away for at least eight years for sneaking into someone else's house. JJ, I'll figure something out. Don't worry about it. Let's try to climb out the window or out of here through the yard, climb the fence, and we're free. Mikey, are you sure? You can't do that. What if we get caught? There's guards out there watching us. It's not legal. What if we end up here for the rest of our lives? JJ, are you with me? Let's go. There's no one here. Mikey, stop. I can't leave. What about me? Did you just leave me? JJ, get out of here. Let's go. Good job, Mikey. I know you wouldn't leave me. No more fighting over girls. I agree with you. The next day. It's been a long time since I've had food like this. Thank you, JJ. Yes, I myself have long wanted to spend time in such a beautiful place, also with such delicious food. Then let's eat and enjoy this beautiful evening. We must have time to eat and taste everything. Let's do it. Dear guests, do you like everything? Is everything all right? Yes, of course. The food is delicious. Thank you. Can I get you anything else? No, thank you. We've had enough of this much food. Is that enough for you, too? I don't need anything. Then I wish you a good evening. If you need anything, you know where to find me. Okay, thank you so much. Now let us enjoy our wonderful meal. Otherwise, it's about to get cold. It's true. I don't like cold restaurant food. That's what I'm saying. That's 
why we have to eat it all. Yeah. Wow, that's a pretty girl sitting right there. Look at that, JJ. Jesus, who's got you so worked up? Wow, and she really is super cute, Mikey. You have a diamond in the rough. I bet you don't have the guts to go up and meet her. What? Why would I do that? I'm willing to bet five diamonds that you can't do it. Are you in? I agree. She is very beautiful, but I won't do it. That's weird, Mikey. I didn't think you'd agree. You're a coward. Oh my god. Okay, I'll do it, but just so you shut up and don't call me names. Good luck to you. I'd love to see her blow you off. I'm so sick of him. All he wants to do is laugh. I'll prove it to him. The important thing is to be confident, JJ. Hey, girl. Hello. I noticed you're sitting alone with so many dishes. Would you like me to help you? Because I don't think a pretty girl like you should be alone. Well, what do you say to that? What are you so worried about? You're funny. I like you. Sorry, this is the first time I've ever done this. Maybe you can give me your phone number and we can continue later? Why wouldn't it be? You're funny and cute. I wouldn't mind hanging out more. I'll text you my phone number. You call me when you can. Wow, I couldn't even expect that. Thank you. I'll be sure to dial it up. Come on, good boy. I'll be very much looking forward to your call. Don't forget about me. Otherwise, I could get very offended and your ridiculous pickups won't work anymore. Thank you so much. I will definitely not forget about such a beauty. Wait for my call. Mikey's gonna be so jealous of me right now. The hottie gave me her number. But how did it come out? You just have to be confident and persistent, and someday you'll be able to take the phone from such a beauty. Seriously? She just gave you the number? Well, what did you think? I'm a real charmer. I didn't believe it at all. I guess I lost. Yes, it is. Give me my winnings, loser. You won fair and square, so I'm giving it to you, even though I'm a little sad. Easy Easiest money I've ever made in my life. I'm waiting for your call, sweet guy. Don't keep me waiting. I'll be sure to call you. I won't miss my chance, beautiful. You're funny. She's very beautiful. I'm even glad you made me go with your insults. I'm kind of glad it worked out that way. Maybe something will work out for you. I hope so, too. Let's go home already, Mikey. It's gonna be dark soon. I agree with you. I was just finishing up while you and your girlfriend were talking. I'm not even surprised that you're a glutton. I don't really want to eat much anymore. I'm happy I didn't get dumped by a pretty girl. You'll owe me. Oh! All in all, it turned out to be a beautiful day today and ate and met a beautiful girl. It's true. Now let's go home happy. That's wonderful. Come on. I don't mind going home either. I'll get some rest and get on with things. I'll see you tomorrow then. Bye. See you later, Mikey. Don't forget about your hottie. Don't let your luck run out. It's gonna be okay. I'm looking forward to our next meeting myself. How could I forget that? Have you guys ever met a girl before? Write in the comments your experience with this. Now I'm going to go home and take a little break from today. It's been very emotional. Although maybe I should call her right away and ask her to meet. I can't stop thinking about her. I definitely need to do that now. Then I need to get my act together and not worry about it. Just calmly pick up the phone and make the call. Okay, I'm ready. It's gonna be okay. If she didn't like me, she'd have turned me down by now. All right, it's ringing. We're waiting. That's it. She should be answering by now. Hey, it's JJ from the restaurant. I'm calling to ask you out. Hey, JJ, I didn't expect you to call me so soon. I told you it wouldn't take long for a beauty like this to show up. So what? You don't mind going out on a date? Of course I don't mind. I'll see you in three hours then. Will you come get me? Will you meet me at the house? Of course I'll come in. Wait for me. I'll see you then, JJ. All right. Whew, that was a little nerve-wracking. But I feel like the luckiest person on this planet now. Now we have to get ready and not be late, or she won't like the first date for sure. It's also important to dress nicely and look neat. It's my first time, so I'm so nervous. Gotta think hard and get going soon. Think JJ three hours later. That's it. I'm packed, and I've already arrived at her house, and I bought some beautiful flowers too. She's gonna love it. Now it's time to go call her and give her flowers. I'm not worried at all. I am now confident that I can do it all. Ringing the doorbell and waiting for our beautiful girl. I hope I hope she wasn't messing with me and this isn't a stupid mean joke. Hey, JJ, I'm glad you came. Sorry it took me so long to open it, but I'm ready to go for a walk. Here you go, pretty girl. It's for you. Beautiful flowers for a beautiful. JJ, that's very nice of you. Thank you so much. I didn't expect that at all. I will always please a beautiful girl. You deserve them. I'm going to put them in a vase so they don't wilt. We'll go for a walk right away. Do you have any ideas where we can go? I don't really have any ideas. I just wanted to walk and talk with you and get to know you better. That's a great idea. I'd like to get to know you a little better, too. I'm very interested in you. Can I at least know how to address you? Because I just call you beautiful and that's it. <laughs> You can call me Speaker Woman, but I really like Pretty Girl, too. That's a wonderful name. 
Do you really work as a programmer? Yeah! That's very interesting. You must make a lot of money. Well, not a lot, but if we keep in touch, I'll be sure to give you gifts. It's not about the gifts, silly. I'm just wondering how you live your life. I'm just thinking about how I'm spending this day with you. I feel so good with you. I am very happy to meet you. It's nice to meet you, too. Let's go to the bridge and see the beautiful view. Let's go, of course. There's just a view of the big river. Look at this place, JJ. It's beautiful. Do you like the way we walk? Of course I like it. It's probably the best day of my life. I've never been happier. This is a very important day for me. I'd like to make a confession to you, JJ. I like you a lot. I'd like to be your girlfriend. Wow, it's like a dream. I want you to be my girlfriend, too. I'm in love with you. It's beautiful. Come to me, my love. I want to spend the rest of my life with you. I'm glad I have you. I love you, JJ. You're the best girl on this planet. Thank you. And you are the most loved and most wonderful guy. I really hope this day never ends. We have our whole lives ahead of us. I'll be with you till the end. Six months later. Today is exactly six months since we started dating my favorite girl. And today is a very important day for me. I want to propose marriage to my beloved to immortalize our love. There's a ring for 16 diamonds that looks so-so to be honest. My future wife deserves an expensive and beautiful ring. Without even thinking, I'm buying this gorgeous ring and going to my speaker woman to ask for her hand in marriage. I'm sure she will be delighted and won't be able to say no to me. Here, these flowers are for you, beautiful. Is that Mikey's voice? What's he doing in there? I think such a beautiful girl should get flowers every day and not turn them down. That's so sweet of you. Thank you so much for making the effort and buying me my most favorite flowers. Don't thank me for it. It's my responsibility to make you happy. You are beautiful. You are very polite and charming. I've never met anyone like you before. Thank you so much for the compliments but you're the only one here who deserves them. I'm ready to talk about your beauty every day. Seriously, on our anniversary, she's cheating on me with my best friend and I was gonna propose to her. I'm very angry and upset with them. It's a disgraceful thing to do. Two hours later. How is that possible? We had such a strong love. How could she do this to me? Though maybe she just didn't want to offend him and decided to accept the gift? I should call and find out from her. Oh no, it's not about her. My best friend, knowing we were in love, allowed himself to do this to me. We need to call him and tell him how horrible a person he is and how horrible what he did was. I'm going to tell him everything. And I thought he was my best friend. The number you have reached is not in service. Recording. Of course he won't answer. He must be a busy boy. Then I'll go and tell him in person. I'm so mad at him. He fully realizes his mistake. I'll show him what it's like to steal other people's girls. He'll be on his knees begging for forgiveness, but he doesn't need to. My fists are itching, but I won't touch him just because of my past. I'll just tell him how bad he is and tell him not to think of me as his friend anymore. I'm so angry. Make him open the door quickly and we'll get this over with. But of course he's so busy after going out with my girl girlfriend. He must be tired. But nothing! I'll go in and see what he's doing that he's not answering anywhere. I love spending time with you. Don't walk away from me. Are they in there together or something? He's screwed if he is. I feel so good with you. Thank you for being in my life. Thank you, my love. You're the best thing I ever had in my life. Then let's spend all our time together. Are you guys out of your minds? What do you think you're doing? Get up and finish lying together. You horrible people. My best friend and my girlfriend are in bed together. We'll explain everything to you. Please, honey, calm down. Don't call me that. I'm not your friend anymore. Damn you. And to you, I'm no longer a boyfriend, no longer a lover. You're all nobody to me. I don't even want to listen to you. Don't ever come into my life again, you bastard. I don't even want to listen to you. Don't ever come into my life again, you idiots. Please forgive me. It will never happen again. Get away from me. You're nothing to me anymore. You're both nothing to me anymore. You two stay here alone. I'm so hurt and sad. I hope no one has ever experienced this. JJ, I'm sorry. She came at me and I couldn't get her away. You're also lying to my face. I saw you giving her flowers and complimenting her. You're a disgrace to this life. I'm sorry. I don't want to lose a friend like you. It's too late. You've already lost it. You should have thought of that before instead of getting involved with your friend's girlfriend. Please forgive me, friend. Get out of here. Don't even come close to me. Why do I deserve this? I've never done anything bad to anyone in my life. I hope you guys have never encountered this and never will. The next morning. Oh, wait. Look over there. <laughs> oh, it's TV woman. She's so cool. She's so beautiful. Mikey, she's mine. She's mine. No, she's mine. JJ, she's mine. 
my... She'll be mine. Don't get in my way. You're the one getting in my way. Hi Mikey, stop. Uh, what's up? Look what you've done. She's running away from us. I'm going to give her so many flowers. No, I'm the one who's going to give her lots of flowers. I will pick more flowers and they will be prettier. I'll pick so many flowers that her attention will be mine immediately. I found this incredible gold ring. Mikey certainly hasn't found anything more beautiful. Now TV Woman will definitely be paying attention to me. Hey, what are you doing here? I'm picking up presents. <gasps> JJ, who's this guy? What kind of TV man is this? <laughs> he gave TV Woman gifts before we did. Attack! You're screwed! Good job, JJ. Here you go, it's for you. Take my flowers, too. All these flowers are just for you, too. Look what a flower <gasps> I found. Don't take his flower. Better keep all my flowers. Don't listen to him. I have the best flowers. What have you done? She's gone. My flowers were better than yours. No, my flowers were better. And now I'm going to give her the best gift ever. I'm going to buy her a great gift. It's going to be the best car of her life. I need to get some money. I finally come to the right place. It's a car dealership. Now that's exactly what I need. These cars are so cool. Hey, hi, are you the manager? Huh, yes, I'm a manager. Hi, I'm glad to see your car dealership. Nice to meet you. Oh, me too. My name is Poopa. I take it you're looking for a dream car? Yes, I am looking for the best car at your car dealership. Oh, I have a special offer for you. We call this car banana. Huh, banana? Because it can safely carry sacks of bananas. It's good. No, that's not what I want at all. Let's take a look at some other cars, too. All right. Oh, it's a perfect match. Yeah. It's a very reliable and modern car. To be honest, even my grandfather rode in such a car. Nah, it's a very old car to me. I'm not a grandfather. All right, then we can look at the police car. She's very, very fast car. No, no, no. This car is definitely not for me. Hmm. <laughs> okay. What kind of beautiful car is this? Oh... And this car, a real terror for people who like quiet ride. How much is this car worth? Five thousand. Five thousand dollars. That's all my money. For the sake of a beautiful TV woman, I don't spare any money. Thank you, sir. I'm sure this car will please your every day. This car costs 1,000 horsepower. It also has a roomy trunk. Cool. There's plenty of room to haul potatoes. I think y'all definitely like this car. I think my future girlfriend will appreciate this car. Thanks for your help. Goodbye. Okay, where's the TV woman's house? I remember she lives somewhere that way. Let's go. Okay, okay. Oh, beautiful TV woman. Your screen is brighter than any other. And your clothes look more beautiful than any flower here. Oh, my TV goddess. Come walk with me. Mikey, get away from my TV woman. What is that? Ah! That's what you deserve, Mikey. The TV woman's mine now. Well, now I'm all set. Hey, TV woman. Come out with me. I've got a cool car. Oh, she's so beautiful. Yay, she agrees to go out with me. That money wasn't wasted. I'm so happy. Uh, girls take so long to get dressed up. But how long do I have to wait now? Oh, there she is. Wow, you're so cool. Did you see my car? This car will be yours, if you're mine. Oh my god, you're okay with me? Yay, Mikey's gonna be jealous when he sees us on a date. I'll take you to my favorite place. Let's hurry up. Oh, hmm, ouch. That JJ has lost his mind. What a car. I'm gonna give her the best gift on the planet. Wait for me, my TV woman. I'll come to you soon. Oh, you're a bright light in my life. You are so beautiful. Your beauty is comparable to this crystal water. I am immensely happy to have met such a divine lady in this scary world. Look at the weather around you. It's as clear as your smile on the faucet of your TV. Can I kiss you? What's that noise? Oh my God, who is it that's interfering with our date? Hey, have you seen this awesomeness? Mikey, no! Wow, JJ. Oh no, did you really like that? Yes, JJ, <laughs> now I'm a TV too, and with a helicopter. How could this happen? That's how you surprise and win the lady of your heart. <laughs> Isn't that right, my TV woman? That can't be right. You wouldn't trade this cool car for a helicopter, would you? Oh no, she's gone. Was she really interested in the fact that Mikey had also become a TV? But I can be a TV too. Only I'm not just wearing TV. I'm going to be a Titan TV man. Cool. Great, I'll do that. But I don't have a proper TV at home. I'll have to go to the appliance store. Oh, it's a store. There's got to be a TV in there. Wow, hello. <gasps> Huh, what? Oh, I saw you. <laughs> it's you again, car salesman. Do you also sell appliances? Oh, hello. Yes, I still do tech sometimes. We have washing machine, a computer, and more here. Maybe you also sell flowers? Flowers? How did you guess? It is my flower store just outside the village. I have the most fragrant flowers. Oh, man. Anyway, I need some nice, cool TV. Do you have one of those? Oh, you're right in the right place. We have a great computer. I need a TV. <laughs> or maybe you need a washing machine too? 
No, I need a TV. All right. I've got one option. This wonderful TV has been waiting hmm. just for you. Yes, this TV fits me. Here's the amount you need. Oh, thank you. I'm in a hurry. Give me my TV. Uh, bye. Where'd you go? Oh. Uh, okay. <laughs> take, take this TV. Finally. Thank you. Maybe I'll stop by your flower store someday. Goodbye. Bye-bye. Yeah, now I can carry out my plan. I have a workshop near here where I can make a Titan TV man out of myself. Uh, let the TV stay here for now. I gotta get my wrench, and now I can get to work. Viewers, do you think I can be a Titan TV man? Write your answers in the comments. I'm going to need that speaker and a couple other things. I finally finished working on my genius project, and now I can confidently show the result of my long suffering. From now on, I'm a TV man Titan, and I have a superpower. Wow, that's so cool. I became the strongest. Mikey will definitely be jealous of me. I've wasted enough time, time to fly to win the heart of my TV woman. I'm sure the end of Mikey and TV woman's relationship is coming now, because I'm the coolest guy here. Oh, my favorite. Did you want to buy yourself some new pants? Here's all my money. <laughs> you don't have to take his money, TV woman. Look at me. Why did you come here? So do you like me a lot better this way? Stop. Ugh. What is that? I knew you'd like me a lot better this way. Oh, no. Did you see that, Mikey? No way. Huh, she turned you down. So, TV woman, will you go on a second date with me now? Ouch. Get out of here, JJ. I'm not going anywhere. Attack. You almost got me, JJ. Take better aim. It'll be worse for you. Surrender, Mikey. You only look strong, JJ. In reality, you're weak. What did you say? I could beat you with a simple flower. You can never beat me. TV woman is mine alone. If I can't beat you, then where are you running to? <gasps> I'm not afraid of you. She'll never be yours. She's mine. She'll be mine. She said that on our date. Oh, my God. Mikey, who's this guy? That TV man is way cooler than you, JJ. <laughs> hey, who the hell are you? <laughs> wow. Oh, TV woman, where are you going? Stop. No way. She traded us for this guy. TV woman, wait. What about me? Oh, my God. Mikey, are you okay? She's gone forever. <laughs> what fools we are, Mikey, fighting over a girl. You're right, JJ. I'm sorry about that. I think this will be a good lesson for us now. Friends forever, Mikey. Of course. I have now realized that even after all the hardships, a friend will always come to my rescue. Uh, Here's a conciliatory flower from me. Oh, that's so nice of you. Once again, I'm convinced you are my best friend. Wow, I'm really excited about this. You're my best friend too, Mikey. Let's go play computer together. Let's go. 2,000 years later. I've got amazing news. There's a really cool computer store around here somewhere. Oh, there it is. I've recently saved up a little bit of money. So I'm going to buy myself a really cool computer. Wow, I've been told this is the coolest store in the entire city. That sounds really cool. Uh, hmm. Okay, I don't need all this stuff. Hmm. Oh, here come the computers. Hmm, this one's cheap. Uh, I don't like this one. Hmm, this one seems okay. Oh my god, this PC is worth 64 diamonds. Wow, that's exactly what I need. Stop, where are all my diamonds? I guess I can't buy my dream computer. It's kind of crazy. Hmm, oh my god. I clearly remember saving up all those 128 diamonds. Where did I lose my diamonds? Oh, wow, it's Mikey. He came out of the mine with his beautiful diamond pickaxe. Hmm, he must have a lot of diamonds. Uh, I have an idea. I'll get Mikey to help me get the right amount of diamonds. Yeah, that's a great idea. Mikey is definitely going to help me in this situation. I wish he'd give me 64 diamonds for nothing. Mikey, hey, it's me, JJ. Mm. I've got something to talk to you about. Oh, hey, JJ. Hey. What's the business you came to my house for? I saw you coming out of the cave. Oh, hmm. You must have unearthed a mountain of diamonds. Oh, yeah, I got a whole bunch of diamonds piled up. That's so cool. All the stuff in my room. Wow, I've never been in your room. Can I come in? Yeah, sure, I'll show you my room. Yeah. Let's go, JJ. Wow, your room is great, and what a nice design. Yes, my room, the most hmm. beautiful and modern room in the whole city. Oh, look, there's something really weird and big outside the window. Yeah, right in that window. JJ, I don't understand. Wow, that's exactly the 64 diamonds I need. What was I supposed to see in the window? It was right there. There's nothing there. There really was something there. Hmm, I heard a sound. Uh, you just imagined it. JJ, I hope you didn't take my diamonds, did you? No, why would I want to trick my friend? <gasps> How could you steal my diamonds? Uh, oh no. Come here, you diamond thief, JJ. Oh my god. <laughs> oh no, Mikey, wait, let me explain. Give all my diamonds back to me. <laughs> no, ah! JJ, I'm not gonna listen to you. Mikey, I just wanted to buy something. Give me back all my diamonds. I really wanted to buy myself a brand new cool PC. Stop. What? 
Yeah. And you didn't think I could save up those diamonds to buy stuff, too. Uh, oh my god. Wow. Oh, I'm so tired of running, Mikey. JJ, I really need those diamonds. But I'm missing all my diamonds. <gasps> I need them, too. Give me back my hard-earned, beautiful stones. Hmm, who's taking a cab? Don't even think about changing the subject right now. Uh, hmm. Whoa, it's the TV woman. Hello, TV woman. Oh, hey, JJ. Hey, Mike. Hey. You're as beautiful as ever. Well, oh. our TV woman. Uh, Busy and lovely as always. Yeah, I agree with you. Did you think I'd say that? Huh, what? You thought I'd forgotten about our situation? Uh. Give me my diamonds. Oh, what? No, these are my diamonds now. I'll give her the best gift without the jewelry and win her heart. Well, go ahead. I'll still make a much better gift for my TV woman than that Mikey. So, guys, I've come up with what would be the coolest TV woman gift ever. I'm even a little worried. Check it out. It's a fireworks store. These are really cool jokes. This surprise is going to be better than Mikey's present. I'm going to give her a huge light show in the sky. She's going to love it. Welcome to our store. Hi, can I take a look around? Yes, of course. Look all you want. Yeah. But remember, everything here is flammable. Okay, this dynamite is too big. Be careful. Well, these fireworks at one diamond apiece will do me just fine. Here are all the fireworks we have in stock. Uh, can I have 64 of these fireworks, please? Your word is law. I'll calculate the amount for you. Hmm. So that's 64 diamonds. Here, take all my money. Oh yeah, thanks for buying. Hmm, can I buy a lot of dynamite from you next time? No problem. Yeah! I'll sell it to you at a slightly lower than average price. Goodbye. Goodbye. What a great store! I bought everything I needed and they gave me a discount on my next purchase. Mikey will definitely be on the losing end. Now I'm going to show TV Woman my surprise, and she will definitely fall in love with me. Hmm. Well. Wow. Is that Mikey's surprise? Oh my god. TV Woman might like it. But I know what I'm going to do. Let's do it. Okay, I'm going to adjust the rope here. Hey, Mikey. Hey, JJ. Is this your present? Yeah, that's my cool big balloon. Mikey. What? Did you hear that? Where? There's free cotton candy for the turtles. <gasps> hurry up and get to it. Then I'll hurry. It was said somewhere over there. Okay, okay. Don't do anything with my TV woman present. Yes, yes. Hurry up or you won't get anything. Huh. What a gullible Mikey. Now I'm going to do what I was planning to do. That's one balloon that's not going to please TV woman. Don't be mad at me, my friend. It's just that in life it happens that in love as in war, all means are good. Oh my God. Huh, let's see what you do now, Mikey. If I didn't, TV woman would probably choose Mikey over me. That's why I don't regret what I did. So it took me a couple hours. The sky is clear. It really took me a long time to build all of this up. I hope she likes it. Yeah, fireworks ready to go off. All I have to do is put some redstone near my lady's house. Now I'm going to run this track and all I have to do is wait for it and start my mechanism. This gift is sure to please TV woman a lot more than Mikey's deflated balloon. Oh, well, here we go. We can go call TV woman. Well, I'll do it. Hey, TV woman, it's me, JJ. Uh, JJ, wait a second. I'll be right out. Uh, okay. Hey, sweetie pie. You're as beautiful as ever. <laughs> Uh, why'd you call me down here? I've got a little present for you. Want to see? Of course I want to see it. Come on. Yeah. Uh, what kind of mechanism is that, JJ? Uh, it's a cool machine you're going to love. Wow, I can't wait to see what this machine does. Look that way. Okay. So what do you think of my gift? This is the best gift I've ever been given. I am very excited about what has happened. I tried really hard for you. JJ, would you like to have a cup of tea with me at my house? Oh, I've never been to your house. Of course you wouldn't, Pi. I'm going to become a Titan TV man to make me look even stronger and cooler in TV woman's eyes. Wow, you look so much cooler now, JJ. Yeah. Come on inside. Let's go quickly. <laughs> JJ is such a sneak. There was no one on that side of that street that gave away free cotton candy. What is that? My beautiful big balloon! Who did this to you? <gasps> oh my god, it's a bow and arrow. All right, that's it, JJ. I'm getting my revenge. And my revenge will be terrible, you'll see. I'm gonna do something truly, truly awful. But I'll get my revenge after I go to TV Woman's. So, what's my lady doing in there while I'm gone? Oh, hmm. This can't be happening. What's going on here? <laughs> You're such a scoundrel, JJ. <laughs> JJ, I had no idea you were such a romantic. Huh, yeah, that's exactly what I am. Those fireworks lit something in my soul. Hmm, were you expecting someone to visit today? I wasn't expecting company tonight. Don't worry, I'll check it out. <laughs> hmm, who is it? Oh, there's no one here. 
Who's trying to make jokes here? Show yourself. Hmm. There's not a soul here. Uh, huh, what? Oh, no. Hee hee hee. All right, JJ. You've been punished for your evil deeds. Huh. I hope you learn this life lesson for a very long time. Now it's my turn to surprise TV woman. One hour later. Oh, my God. What happened? Where I am? I don't remember anything. It's Mikey and TV woman. Oh, and the balloon's in place. My dear, look at my balloon. Let's go for a ride him and enjoy the beauty of this nature. Mikey's so good. He's back with TV Woman, and he fixed the balloon. I'm going to make it up to him and apologize. The next morning. Oh, yeah, I had such a great night's sleep that I practically don't even have any pain at all. What? Who else is here? I wasn't expecting any guests today. Hi, JJ. I'd like to apologize to you. Can I come in? Hi, of course. Welcome. Wow, your home is beautiful and so clean. Well, we'll talk about that later. Look what I got. It's a treasure map. What? Where'd you find her? Found it in an old chest. I have in my attic. That's really cool, but it looks like it's a long away. That's okay, JJ. So it's going to be an exciting adventure. You're right, Mikey. Let's hurry up. I really want to find out what treasure is hidden there. Me too. Mikey, then let's run faster. We're almost there. The map shows it's somewhere around here. That's very cool, Mikey. But I don't see anything here. Let's check the map. Okay. Uh, I found it. It's here. Good job, Mikey. Here, take these tools. You'll need them. Uh, okay. Well, what are you going to do when I'm digging all this up? I'll make sure no one's around. All right. You talked me into it. I hope nothing else falls from above. JJ, did you find it yet? Wow, I didn't find it. I found the treasure. What's in here? Oh my god! No way! There's so many diamonds. We gotta get them all. We got rich. I can't believe it. Mikey, Mikey, I found the diamonds. Now help me get out of here. What did you say? Diamonds. Take the ladder and get out of there. Okay, Mikey. I'll be right there. Now I have diamonds. I should apologize to Mikey. We did it! Yes, JJ! We did it! Now let's split our find in half! Here's your half, Mikey! Thank you, JJ! Wait! That's not all! I'd like to apologize for everything I've done! Here's my apology! Thank you, JJ! I forgive you! You're my best friend after all! Okay! Let's go home then, shall we? I still have things to do! I agree! Let's go! It's this way! Let's hurry up! Okay! I'm so happy! I have diamonds! And now, I can buy the computer I've been dreaming of for so long! Hi! Hello, can I help you with something? Yes, I need all the computers you have in your range. Are these prices correct? Oh, I'm sorry, the prices have tripled. What? Why didn't you change the price tags? I'm joke! Uh, well, that's good. So I'll take all those items. Good choice, sir. Here are your computers. Oh yeah! I'm glad you purchased this from us. Finally! Thank you so much. Have a good day, mister. Have a nice day, and come back again. Okay. I'm so excited. This is the best purchase ever. A few moments later. I already have a couple ideas of what to do. I definitely need to put up a Christmas sock, or better yet, two. It's more beautiful that way. There should definitely be a Christmas house on the table. It looks great. Well, what's New Year's Eve without a beautiful snowman? Everything looks so much better now. But the most important thing in this holiday is the Christmas tree. Mikey will be here soon to bring it. And here comes the New Year's tree. How huge and beautiful it is. JJ, it's not as light as you think. Hurry up and tell me where to take it, or my arms will fall off. Let's get her to our room. I've just had time to spruce her up a bit. This is the best Christmas tree I can find. All the others are expensive and ugly. Oh, I like her a lot. You did a great job. I just need to figure out where to put it. What's to think about? Put it here. It's the perfect place. Now it looks like our room is already festive. She fits in perfectly here, although I feel like something else is missing. I don't know. I'm fine with it. Like, it's enough. What about the presents that should be under the Christmas tree? Yeah, you're right. This 
should be in our room, too. See how naked it looks under the Christmas tree. You'll have to go to the store again and buy everything. And you thought I'd forgotten about that? I was just messing with you, silly. You're a sly one trying to play a trick on me? Of course, I love doing it. Here's a bunch of presents for you under the tree. Now everything's gonna look perfect. Now that looks perfect. It's a total New Year's Eve feeling with these gifts. Now that we're all done, now we can go rest in the room, JJ. In general, yes. I really like our work. Let's go to the room. We'll think about things there. I agree. I'm getting a little sleepy already. Except I have a question. Is Santa coming over tonight? Oh, right. I totally forgot about that. If he comes, what are we gonna do? I don't even know. We don't really have much of an option to do anything. Or do you have any ideas? You know, here's an idea. Let's put a trap in front of the door so we know if he's coming. Sounds like a great idea. Let's do it. I've got a trap right here. So we'll know for sure if Santa's coming. Do you have everything in your pockets that we need? Of course I'm prepared. Let's put it here and go to the room so Santa doesn't suspect a thing. Okay, we'll leave it like that. It's the best place ever. If Santa comes in, he'll step on her in the dark and our plan will work. Then we leave the trap here and go to our room and go to bed. Yeah. And if Santa comes, we'll definitely hear it. You sometimes come up with some things that seem silly but turn out to be genius. There's no other way. Let's just go to our rooms. I'm sleepy. Then you and I lie down and expect a miracle. Good night. You too. I love the lead up to the new year so much. The best emotions in life. Happy new year to you guys. May all your wishes come true. And now to bed. Ah, it hurts so bad. What is this? What's the setup? What's all the yelling? What's the matter? Was it just me? I gotta go see what that was. I wonder if Mikey's awake. JJ, I heard some kind of screaming. It was very loud and scary. Mikey, I got it. Our trap worked. Looks like Santa came to us and stepped in it. I'd completely forgotten about our trap. It's definitely Santa. Let's hurry up and look. I always believed he'd come to us. Let's see what he looks like. Help me already. I'm tired of standing here. Who the hell are you? Why did you put that there? What's wrong with you? I didn't realize Santa looked like that. I'm filling in for Santa. Set me free and I'll tell you everything. I like this Santa even better. She looks really cute. It's true. A very pretty girl. Does Santa like that come to everyone, I wonder? Or just to us? Why don't you just cut me loose and not just stand there? Of course we'll set you free, beautiful. And then we'll sit down and spend some time together. Thank you, good man. Mikey, what are you doing? Why are you so blatantly hitting on her? I don't do anything like that. I'm just telling a girl she's beautiful. Why can't I do that? Thank you so much. You are are very nice and beautiful too. You're free now. I'm sorry we did this to you. We didn't think a pretty girl was coming over. We were expecting Santa. It's not a big deal. I'll give you a kiss on the cheek as a token of my appreciation. Oh, wow. Thank you so much. I've never been kissed by a girl this beautiful before. I was actually the first one to hear that you were caught in a trap. What's your problem? I see my savior. He saved me. He's better than you. Wait, what? JJ, stay out of our way and don't be jealous. Can't you see we're in love? You better go to your room. Are you out of your mind, Mikey? That's very brazen of you. Go, JJ, don't be jealous. Cool. My best friend picked her and sent me to the room, and the girl picked him. I'm totally disappointed. Why don't we go for a walk tomorrow? They're also going out for a walk. I don't even want to listen to them anymore. Give me a like if you think Mikey did a bad thing. I'm very angry. The next day. Good morning. A new day begins. Why is Mikey's door open? Is he awake yet? He's not here. Then where could he be? Is he downstairs already? Oh, Jesus. What's he doing in there by the mirror? Is he admiring himself in there? Mikey, what are you doing? Why are you looking in the mirror? Are you awake yet? I'm looking at how I look. I'm going out with a hot girl tonight. We agreed to meet in an hour. What? No. What? Why would you even make a deal? It doesn't have to be like this. I may have liked her too, and you didn't act like a friend. JJ, it's not my problem that she chose me over you. You could have just been happy for me. You didn't even give me a chance. You just humiliated me by sending me to your room. You should be grateful to me for that. Stay home alone, you resentful. I'll stay. It's better than being with you. Now he's going to go for a walk happy. Next time, try being more polite to everyone. He didn't even ask me to to go with them. But it tells me to be polite to him. I don't even have words to describe him. I don't even want to think about this whole thing anymore. Three hours later. I love spending time with you so much. I think it's fate that we met. It's true. I enjoy our walks too. I feel very comfortable being with you. I'm very happy about that. Thank you for that. Listen, I'm a little cold walking around. Plus it's snowing hard. Why don't we go over to my house to warm up? If you don't mind, I'd love to. 
Since I'm suggesting it, I'm certainly not against it. We'll sit and talk for a while, and then maybe we'll go for another walk. Or we'll figure something out. Is that okay with you? I never mind. I'd have to warn JJ about that, though. He'll probably be worried if I don't come back tonight. But whatever, let's just go straight to your place. It's not that big of a deal, really. Let's go! That's great! I was sure you wouldn't say no. The two of us are going to have a great time together. It's true, especially since JJ didn't behave very nicely, so we can safely enjoy each other. That's great! And here's my humble cabin. You can make yourself at home here. That's a nice house you got there, as beautiful as you are. And you keep telling me I'm beautiful. Hee hee hee. Wow! It looks even better up close than it does from afar. That's quite a place you got there. This is the kind of house I bought for myself. I'd live here all day long. It's not every day you see a place like this. That's the kind of mystery girl I am. Can we please stop just standing around looking at the house and go inside? I'm freezing! Yeah, I'm sorry. I just can't turn my back on him. I'd look at you a lot longer, though. How lucky I am to have a girl like that. I hope we can be together. Okay, let's go. There's not much to do in my house, but we won't be distracted. It's true. I'm glad of it. Wow, it looks even better on the inside. I'm so lucky to have you. It's actually quite modest. You go ahead and look at everything, and I'll be right there. Okay, I'll wait for you. I'm almost done. There's not much left. I'm so tired of him already. It's time to start my plan. Now we're gonna be mature with him. I'm tired of it already. It's time to finally get rid of it. Hey, what are you doing? What's wrong with you? Ah, don't touch me. So you're not your usual pretty girl. You're your usual horrible maniac. Did you really think you and I could be a couple together? That's never gonna happen. Now sit there silently. How awful you are, let me out. Sit here and wait for your time, my friend. Don't hurt me. I know what to do and what not to do, naive little child. I'll have you to answer for all my time wasted on you. In the meantime, I'm going to go eat. Two hours later. While Mikey is out there having fun with the girl, I sit and play on the computer and am quite happy about it. But at the same time, it's getting pretty late and Mikey still isn't home. He always comes home at this time. Guess I should go look for him. I will. Even though we had a fight, I'm always worried about him. Although maybe he was just out for a walk and didn't even warn me. Guys, write in the comments, would you go looking for your loved one? Or would you sit at home and wait? I personally can't do that, although I'm sure Mikey wouldn't go looking for me. Hopefully after this, he will realize that I respect him. People told me that this huge house is the girl's house. She knows exactly where Mikey is. How can a girl like that have such a huge house? It's awful. But okay, that's not why we're here. We just need to find out where Mikey is and go on looking for him. Now we wait for the girl to open it for us. Well, what's taking her so long to open it? By the way, why don't you pick a flower and give it to her? Why, that's a great idea. Maybe she'll like me better than Mikey after all. That's better. Just have to wait for her and give her a little gift. I think she'll be happy. Who's that? Oh, is that you? What are you doing here? How did you know where I live? I went looking for Mikey and they told me where you live. And this is for you, a little gift from a beautiful girl. Wow, you really surprised me a lot. Thank you so much. That's very sweet of you. You're so much better than Mikey. That's what I thought. Do you know where he is? Because he's not home. He's stupid, I chased him away. Why don't you come over to my place and we'll spend some time together? Yes, of course, how could I refuse such a beautiful girl? That's great, come on in and make yourself comfortable here. Thank you, pretty lady. Thank you, love. Okay, JJ, I'm gonna go powder my nose now. Can you wait for me here? Just don't go anywhere. Uh, sure, honey. I'll wait as long as you tell me to. What a nice guy you are. Am I nice? That's so good to hear. Wait here and you'll be even nicer in a couple minutes. Hee <laughs> hee. It's a good thing Mikey didn't work out with her because I'm handsome and smart and brave and cool and Mikey's not. Hey, I can actually hear you. What? Mikey, he's sitting in that closet? Did I just hear that? Is this some kind of prank they pulled on me? Write about it in the comments. I don't like jokes like that at all. Uh, what kind of prank? Let me out of here already. But what are you doing in this closet? That stupid woman put me in here. Did you just say I'm stupid? How long since you got punched in the face? Hey, Mikey, I was kidding. Take it easy. What are you doing here? You have to apologize first. Guys, don't apologize. What were you doing in the closet? Were you spying on us? Uh, no. That stupid woman attacked me with a knife and tried to kill me. And then she put me in this closet. Then she went to seduce you. And she succeeded. She hasn't accomplished anything. 
nothing. I'm just here for fun. Yeah, for fun. You were over the moon when a pretty girl talked to you. Oh, she's already here. What are you two doing here? I told you to stay in the closet and you wait here. It's not a big deal. I'm going to stab you both. Oh my god, we got a problem, Mikey. Stop, calm down. I'll cut you into little pieces for my soup. It's gonna be a great dinner. Oh, I don't think my stove is working. How am I supposed to grill you? I wonder if the oven works or not. So go check it out. What are you waiting for? Okay, okay, okay. Just wait here, all right? Of course, we'll wait for you. Take your time. Oh, you're a genius, JJ. It's time for an escape from this scary house. And you wanted to punch me in the face for saying that. We'll talk about that later. Right now, we need to get out of here as fast as we can. We'll talk about that later. Right now, we need to get out of here as fast as we can. Still, she easily seduced both of us. Who else is an idiot? I'll have to think about that. Otherwise, she'll catch up with us and slaughter us. Hey, stop right there. My dinner will not escape my knife. Goodbye, crazy woman. Yeah, you're stupid and crazy. No one's gonna date you. Hee hee hee. Nice work, JJ. Friends, don't forget to subscribe to our channel. Like this video. Would you like to see such Santa Claus at Christmas? Write about it in the comments. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.